Hold the line. Don't fall to the Chaos Forces. Phoenix has fallen. Our defenses aren't enough. I must call on help from the gods. Neith, the Egyptian weaver of fate. You have arrived just in time. Hurry, defend the Phoenix until it respawns. Use the left and right stick to get there. Here comes a wave of enemy minions. Destroy them. Use the right stick to aim, then fire your bow when you're ready. Each time you slay an enemy or destroy an objective, you gain experience or XP. Gain enough XP and you will level up, allowing you to unlock abilities. Unlock Spirit Arrow, Neath's first ability. By default, your abilities will be trained automatically for you after this tutorial. Watch out! More enemies are approaching! You must use your powerful ability. Spirit Arrow is a line attack that can strike multiple enemies within its highlighted area. Use the targeter to help direct you when casting your abilities. With the targeter visible, press the button to fire. The Phoenix has respawned. Excellent work. Head back to the fountain and let's prepare to advance. You've taken a lot of damage and need to replenish your health. Teleport back to the fountain now. Within the fountain, gods will rapidly gain health and restore their mana. Gold can be used to purchase items from your team's item store, but only while you are in your base fountain. Open the item store now to purchase some items. This view is your recommended list and shows items most likely to help you in your role. One of these items is Light Blade, which increases your damage and the speed of your basic attacks. Select the item Light Blade to purchase. At level 1, you can choose your first relic. Relics can be used like abilities, but don't require. Finally, let's buy a consumable item. Unlike relics, consumable items can be very good. These items will help you in your battles. Our tower is under siege. Go now! Your tower is under attack from enemy minions. Go there now and defeat them. Your middle tower is under attack. Impressive. The relic you chose earlier, Meditation, can be used to replenish health and mana for yourself and for your allies. Use that relic now. Now it's time for payback. Push to the enemy tower! Remember to stay behind your minions so that they take the brunt of the tower's attack. If the tower targets you, fall back out of range. God Ymir has joined the fight. Defeat him and move on to the enemy phoenix. Enemy gods are a greater threat and are usually controlled by enemy players. You should defeat this god before moving on. First blood. 
ahead is the enemy Phoenix, which can only be damaged by your basic attack. Once destroyed, all of your minions in mid lane will spawn with upgraded weapons and deal more damage. Unlike towers, a Phoenix will eventually respawn. Destroy the enemy Phoenix, but remember to let- War enough! I will handle it myself! <laughs> with Neath on my side, you have no chance. <sighs> we shall see. Storm into the enemy base and destroy their titan to win. Congratulations, you have won your first game. Like if you enjoyed this video. Let us know what you think in the comments below. And subscribe for more. See you next time.